In this video, I will show you how to mod a Pathfinder Kingmaker. The first thing you have to do is download Unity Mod Manager, this program here, link in the description. You just need to click on manual download and it will download it for you. Then you need to find your mods at Nexus Mods, link in the video description. And I want to install Fast Travel and this one to make me able to respec. So just download those files. I have already downloaded them, so I don't need to. Then you will have these files in your downloads folder. I've dragged them out to my desktop, so it's easier to see. You have to extract this file. You can use WinRAR, 7-zip, or some other program like that. Then you will have this folder. Unity Mod Manager is a file in this folder. Just double click on it, and you can install the mod for the game. Remember, pick the right game, so Puffin Kingmaker in this case. So now the mod manager is installed. Now we'll need to drag in the mods I want on this drag and drop place, the zip files. And nothing comes up here and gives me an error. But when I restart the program, the mods are here. So it works. So let's show you that it worked. So here you can see that I have mod manager, the version and the mods. Status shows me that they're active. On off, I can press those buttons to turn them off or on. And I can also see here that there's an update available for one of the mods. I can save my settings or close the mod manager here. So let's go into a game. So you see, my characters move faster right now, because I have that mod installed. And if I press Ctrl F10, I will get the mod menu up. So here I can click on fast travel to get the options for it. So non-combat movement speed I can increase to 300%. And then save. And they move a lot faster. Same thing with global map speed, so I can have it up to 200%. Save, let's leave this area. So this is a lot faster than it usually is. Now for respecking the respecking mod, it only works for your main character. And the first thing you should do is turn off every ability, like this power attack and such. Because right now when I'm recording this video, it has some problems when you do this. Because you will keep those things activated on your new character and you can't turn them off. And they stack with themselves. So you can definitely cheat the system that way or just screw yourself a lot. So turn it off. And I would also recommend just removing everything from your character. I had some stuff getting duplicated before, some torches. So remove everything from a character, just in case. Control F10, respecialization mod, recreate main character. And I want that pro portrait, I want to be a gnome, left-handed, male, barbarian. You see, like, you can change everything. So it's really good for that. If you have, if you like this video, like it if you want some more videos from me, subscribe to my channel, and thanks for watching.